How are you? I hope you are doing well. Uh, today I want to talk about what are the worst scenarios in the growing saffron farm. I mean disease and disorders. The majority of the disease and disorders that you may be faced them. I have divided in the three stages. First stage related to the before sorting and after sorting and after the buying the saffron bulbs okay in the usually in the july and august in the northern hemisphere and the january and february in the southern hemisphere maybe you face with them the first step is the uh, the fungal diseases of the uh, rhizoctenia you can see rhizoctenia how you can destroy the saffron bulbs rhizoctenia is the most dangerous diseases in the fungal diseases rhizoctenia as you can see completely rotted completely die has the ability and to be honest and we cannot receive even any one flower from these bulbs they don't have any activity if you want to buy the saffron bulbs please in the reliable companies you should buy saffron it is enough one saffron bulbs in the one in the 50 kilogram saff healthy saffron bulbs one of these saffron bulbs is enough to destroy other saffron bulbs therefore even one to other infected infect infects the other healthy saffron bulbs therefore very take care if you want to buy saffron bulbs all of them should be healthy and you can see this is the left one. This is the beginning of the infection, and after that, converted to the here. Yeah. And this, and the second shape also this related to the sorting. Also related to the sorting, this is the effects of the mites. And the mites can destroy this shape. Mite also like the rhizoctenia has the ability. 100% of the one bulbs remove 100% of the saffron bulbs mite and the rhizoctenies are very dangerous and the third one also related to the buying after buying the saffron bulbs in the sum times you can see in the 5% very a small black spot okay these are like the fungal diseases but not rhizoctonia you know, as you can see, the 80% of 90% of the saffron bulb is healthy, only a small. In this kind, maybe uh, the high temperature during transportation will be high, or the in the land or the ground that they harvest. Uh, for example, when they have the rainy weather, the time of the harvesting of the saffron bulb, high humidity and the high temperature maybe cause this infection. But this is not very dangerous but it's better even you short and take them out like the bulb it's better but in this bulb you can receive flowers but the number will be low but i recommend even in the sorting you should remove this one these three disorder related to the sorting or the time of the buying the saffron bulbs these three pictures you should uh, uh, remove them sort them with the care you should train the workers with the meticulous and step by step see the saffron bulbs. Uh, the fourth one is related to the before flowering. You know, as you can see, this is the top of this has a burning. Okay, this uh, the saffron sprout start to starting to the burning. The main reason for this is the light when unfortunately in the saffron vertical farm that install the light between two shelves is a run installing the line between the shelves is a run and sometimes you can see only we have the 30 centimeters distance between distance between the light and the sprout and the sometimes 20 centimeters 30 centimeters enough that the burn the top of the sprout and the flower is not able coming out from the sprout and because when the light distance between the light and the spread will be near, near very close and the light start to the burning the top of the 
the tip of the sprout and kills the flower inside the sprout. Therefore, this is not normal. I don't recommend installing. It should have a suitable distance between the light and the and uh, totally I don't recommend installing the lights between the shelves you can see a start from the top to the black uh, spot and 10 to, uh, 3 centimeters lower you can see another black spot that is not suitable and another tip the type of the flowering you can see 10% uh, of the 10% of the saffron bulbs face with the black spot this is only reason the high humidity in the time of the flowering giving the water directly to the bulbs I told you we shouldn't give the water to the bulb directly you should always in this stage especially in the flowering you should just keep relative humidity any one drop before flowering during flowering even one drop of the water shouldn't face uh, with the saffron bulbs the bulb should receive from the humidity indirectly only with the keeping relative humidity therefore the main reason is the high humidity flower as you can see uh, even with this problem s started to the flowering and another things you see four pictures later the time of the propagation the disease and disorder that you face in the propagations is provide for you a lot of problems because the bulbs want to start the propagation and even a small disease disorder is equal equivalent with the small bulbs in the new bulbs converted to the small bulbs. The first one is the cobweb mold. We have also this disease in the mushroom. Cobweb, like the cobweb, a spider cobweb in the substrate you can see this is the saffron leaves and this cup they have like the spider that is a this is the mold this is a dangerous mold maybe in the previous time when you cultivate other things like the other plants other crops because they are similar with majority of the crops in this phase it is uh, we shouldn't allow creating the cup some people use the baking soda, some people use the salt with the spraying salt in the infected. But these are temporary combat. The best thing preventing. You shouldn't allow before growth before the period, you should disinfect the room with the best way, with the cooking out, not the only a spraying fungicide or insecticide. You should use cook out increase temperature you should reach the temperature your room temperature to the 60 centigrade eight hours the best for the best way for cleaning all contamination this is the best way you should uh, six months to six months you should uh, cook out your room another thing the leaves started to the spiral like the coil like the curly shape you know this is not soft like curly like the spiral like the coil this is the propagation. Then you see this shape, the curly shape. I myself, this is a harvested the saffron bulb. Then you see the spiral, the saffron bulbs converted to the carrot. Any, when you see this shape of the leaves that is a completely curly. Without that, when you harvest the saffron bulb from the soil, you can see bulbs converted to the carrot, not like the circle. All the saffron bulbs should be like the onion, like the circle, not like the carrot. You can see this, this is like the carrot, like the carrot. You are not able with the carrot shape receive even the one flower. This is equal with the removing the bulbs, okay? Therefore, you should not allow Carroting shape, not the carrot, okay? All the saffron bulbs, not the carrot. When you see this shape, without that, the leaves like the curly shape. When you see the curly, 100%, they are very direct relation between the uh, carroting saffron bulbs and the spiral leaves. 
What is the main reason? The cultivation depth. When you consider the cultivation depth very low, when you use very weak and uh, uh, very weak uh, substrate and the local cultivation depth converted to the carity. You should consider suitable cultivation depth. And another thing, this is the yellowing. Half of the, I told you in the previous videos, when we have the yellowing after the three months or four months, it means when we have the four months, the green leaves, after four months, started to the yellowing is a normal thing. But even after the two weeks, after the one month, two months, start to the yellowing, or half of them, or the tip of them start to the yellowing, that means you have the problems. Three or four months, your task always, the saffron leaves should be green. When it's yellow, high temperature, using high nitrogen in your substrate, and giving high level water. High water, or sometimes low water. Therefore, it needs have a balance between the water and the evaporation. But the main reason is the high temperature in the one in the room that they don't have any control of the control temperature. And about this shape, this is happens at the time of the flowering. When you have the instead the three S stigma, six S stigma. This is the and it's not on your hand. This is the genetic origin. This is the abnormality. But some farmers, you know, when you see these things, you shouldn't see, you shouldn't be happy. Okay, instead of the 3 stigma, I have a 6 stigma. Okay, my yield will be double. No, the quality will be low, will be decreased, the quantity will be decreased. And some of my uh, students ask me, okay, this is a very good thing. Is it possible uh, with the genetic, all of them will be converted to the 6 instead of the 3 stigma? This is not good thing that we want to in the chromosome, in the, with the genetic that we want to increase. Normal is the three stigma. It means, okay, I have two hands. Is it not normal? Yeah, I, I want to four hands, five hands. Okay, this is not good things. Therefore, it's better the normal things. This is the or genetic origin. And when the petals converted to the white, the best color is the purple, not the white. Why this happens? This is the main reason is the using the chemicals, especially in the urea, especially the nitrogen. When you don't have any balance between the nitrogen and potassium and phosphorus, without that you face with this. When the nitrogen go a lot of and uh, very decomposed chicken manure, cow manure, without considering potassium or phosphorus, on using only chemicals, nitrogen, chemical nitrogen like the urea, this and converted to the purple and also affecting the stigma and you won't have uh, the best suffer and about this the stigma has a curly shape has a spiral shape has a cold shape this also happens two reasons one of them is after the drying saffron we have the two way in the we should have the dry saffron in the correct way if you don't know anything, if you don't know about the drying saffron or if you don't have the machine for the drying, if you don't know how you can press and then dry it, all the saffron should be clearly shaped like the spiral and the quality. You cannot sell your saffron in the good price, in the suitable price. All people love saffron completely soft, completely straight. Okay, when you drying, this is the for the started to the spiral. This is reason for the drying. And you have the problem in the prime. After the drying, if the before drying has a good shape, okay, no problem. But if after drying, the stigma converted to the spiral shape or the curly shape, problem in the drying system. If from the first, when it is uh, connected to the flowers, before the rhyme even has a spiral. This is a viral disease. That's very dangerous and really happens in the saffron vertical farm. But sometimes, if you see it, before the rhyme or all of your stigma like the spiral, it means you have have you have faced with a viral disease. And this is the uh, withering or the destroying the petals. You know this happens. When you don't have, when you have a lot of saffron flowers and you don't have enough time for the harvesting, or you harvest the saffron, the petal with the stigma, and after the two days, 
back because too much flower you have and you cannot manage separating the stigma from the petal. When this happens and you don't have any control in the workers, all the started to the police again. I, this all converted to the will wither. All the saffron petal started like the wither and spoiling and it will be dying. It will be dying, you know, like this. This is the not fresh flower. You have time after harvesting flower from the bulbs. You have maximum 24 hours. If B, instead of 24 hours, 28 hours, 30 hours, all the petal connected to the stigma and will be withered due to high humidity because we have 100% humidity inside the petal. You should immediately, my, I recommend immediately after harvesting, you should start with the process of the separating. If you don't know and they put the saffron in the back in the for over 20 hours, 30 hours, and when you want to back, you see all the saffron bulb wither and you don't you, you are not able to separate uh, the stigma from the petal that you lose you will lose all of your efforts for the saffron farm i hope you enjoy of this video thank you